Welcome to the J&O Show. We talk about what do women really want from relationships? Like for real, for real. Hmm. Forever, forever, ever. Okay, I'm done. So sexy to me when he does masculine shit. When I see him working on the yard, when I see him fixing the house, when I see him just like talking to a guy in a certain way and his like masculine tone comes out and, mm-hmm. and I just see him in real life or like he views someone in the store and he's like, ah, they're moving a little funny, get on this side of me. Like mm-hmm. that is sexy. See, women want that and it's a primal thing yeah. it's it's a procreation yeah. thing you know we want to be whether women want to admit it or not we want to be soft we we, we want to be around a man that we don't got to embrace our masculinity right because that man will go and embrace his masculinity and equally so i feel like men also don't want to be masculine all the time you know there's times where they want to come home and they want peace and they want love and they want somebody they could just be like their little self with this is your safe space and just recharge him for life i like this one it's good what do you think about this (laughs) that girl good that boy is good Mm. (laughs) no i detect no lies in what she shared i think that's very true and that's something that we've spoken on i know i've spoken on depending on what order these videos come out and we i just spoke on it Mm. in one of the videos we need to change the narrative as far as what we want as women because we hear we want equality we want you know we want to be basically viewed just like men. And in actuality, that's not what it is hmm. because we want to be soft. We don't want to have to be hard. We don't want to have to go out and do the more masculine things all the time. I understand that some of us have to do it, especially like if you're a single parent, but having to do something and wanting to do something is two different things. But I wholeheartedly agree with her. Like it's definitely attractive to see a man in his ma- in his masculinity. Just like I think it's very attractive attractive for men to see women in their femininity Mm. like that's just naturally how we're built (laughs) one of the things that she mentioned something as simple as being out and about and you recognizing that something seemed a little off or might not be right you automatically go into protection mode Mm -hmm. that is attractive because by nature women we want to be protected and we want to be provided for so like anytime a man is doing those things I feel it's automatically going to be something that is attractive because just innately that's something that we want that we desire so when we see it when we have it it's attractive Mm -hmm. do you think that a lot of women truly want a partner or do you think that most women want a husband I think most women want a husband okay The partner in which we see it being televised as, no, I don't think that's necessarily what women want. Hmm. Not deep down inside. Okay. I don't think that's what they want. And when I say what we see being advertised, partnership where everything is equal on both sides. Mm -hmm. Like we want to be partners, like, uh, like we're equally doing everything the same type thing. And I don't think that that's true. Partnership maybe in the sense that like, I got your back, you have mine. Mm -hmm. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay, I see you over there handling that. I'm going to make sure I'm over here handling this, taking care of that. In that respect, yes, I Mm -hmm. think. Yes. But I don't think in the partnership, as far as like what you hear and what you see in our modern society and on television, like, okay, well, no, it's 50 50. He's going to work 40 hours a week, 50 hours a week, 60 hours a week. I'm going to work 40, 50 hours a week. You know, he's out here going to get the car fixed. I can go get the car fixed. You know what I'm saying? Like different things like that. I don't think that that's what women truly want. And if you guys made it this far, go ahead and smash that subscribe button, turn on your post notifications, and give us a thumbs up so that way YouTube can know that you appreciate what we're putting down. What we're putting down. down. Okay, well, I'm interested, guys. What do y'all think women truly want? Yeah. I am. Comment below. Yeah. I'm, and I'm, let us know what you I, think. I, I think that there's a nature for women to want men to move a certain way. And mm-hmm. I think that my wife here pretty much summed a lot of that up. I don't disagree, but. I'm also not in the dating market. So I don't know what it's like for you guys that are still dating. I've been married for almost 20 years at this point. I don't know what women nowadays are really moving like, what they really think. I think that biologically we have an attraction to certain things in the opposite sex. But I don't know 100% if nature versus nurture has so much of the nurture taken over where women are actually really on some I want 50-50 because Mm -hmm. I hear a lot of like when we were watching one of them love is blind love 
love rubbing your feet, whatever the heck it is now. They doing a whole lot of love is doing this and love is doing all types of stuff. Mm-hmm. But whatever we were watching, a lot of the guys were like, yeah, I want to lift you up and I want to, you know, I want to make you shine and all of this other stuff. And I was like, OK, OK. okay. And then I waited to see the, what the woman would say. And she would be like, I love the way you lift me up and make me shine and that you, you know, you prioritize me. And then, you know, and I love you for it. <laughs> and I sort of go what uh, and that's exactly why I said that no women truly do not want partnership I just not, not partnership in that sense where everything is 50-50 they don't want I, that but I, no I just I'm confused yeah I'm confused too we're confused because it wasn't no reciprocation it was all it was all one way and the man was sitting there like yes I bow down so that I can worship you and the woman was like yes thank you bring me all the adulation I appreciate it <laughs> You get to enjoy being in my in my presence. You're so lucky. Ew, no. He's so lucky. <laughs> just, you know, so I'm really wondering what's going on. That's yeah. all. I'm just putting stuff out there for y'all to think about in the comment on this in, in the comment section. So mm-hmm. y'all can get some clarity because I don't really know what's going on. Yes. And I would like for y'all to inform us so that we can, you know, start to be like, OK, look, in marriage, that's going to suck. Don't do that no more. Nope. We, we've been we've been here for 20 years. I'm telling you, we probably whatever y'all want to do. We probably tried it because we, we we tried a lot of stuff. We probably tried it. We could tell y'all stuff that suck and stuff that don't suck. Yeah. So, you know, just put it in the comment section. We'll come back and be like, no, don't do that. Don't ever do that again. You about to destroy your marriage. You ain't even going to get married. How you going to get down the aisle? You wondering why you single. That's why you single. Like we going we gonna to let you know these things because the reality is men is only going to put up with so much. They will put up with a lot, but they only going to put up with so much. Mm-hmm. And if you get a guy that will put up with everything, you're not going to like him no way. That part. Mm-mm. So it's good in the beginning. Oh, he's going to do everything. And a few years later, he's so, I can't stand him. He's so weak. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He don't handle no business. Mm-hmm. So trust me, it'll turn on you, even if you get everything you think you want. Yeah. That was it. I don't got nothing else to say. I thought it was a very interesting little point that she put out there. I just mm-hmm. want to know what you guys have to say about it. Yes, but we need you, the village, you guys, mm-hmm. right there. You sitting on the sofa. Yes. And you at work. I see you too. Look, I yes. don't want to call you to get fired <laughs> now. But we need y'all to go ahead and comment your thoughts below. Especially ladies. I'd be very intrigued to hear what your take is on this. Do you feel as though women today really want partnership, true partnership, as in 50-50, equal on everything? Okay. Or do you think it's more of a mix? Do you think that we need to change the conversation and stop saying that we want partnership in that sense and also true equality? Because true equality means that when we go on dates, I'm paying for half, he paying for half. Okay, and everything and everything else like it's literally 50 50 straight down the line. So comment down below and let us know your thoughts. Okay, guys, I need you to do me a favor. I need you to hit that like button. Mm-hmm. I need you to hit that subscribe button. Uh-huh. I need you to hit that notification button. Mm-hmm. I need you to hit all the buttons. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, everybody. Down in the description, there are two links. One is to a GoFundMe. And the other one is to a video that explains what the GoFundMe is for. Mm-hmm. Long story short, we have a medical situation with our daughter that we have to pay for everything out of pocket. And we can really use you guys' help. Yes. If you have the time, uh, we'd love for you to go check it out. If you have the money, the funds, we'd love for you guys to help. If not, maybe you could send a link to somebody else who can help. Uh, we thank you for your time. Thank you. Peace. Press the off button. <laughs>